You know, I love hearing stories and I love telling stories. You know why? Because it reminds me when I was pint-sized. <laughs> this story took place in 1988 on the May long weekend in the Waterton Lakes National Park. There were two couples camping together at the Crandell campground. It was shortly after midnight when the four friends were sitting around the campfire enjoying their company. And all of a sudden, they heard some snorting and they thought, well, maybe it was a deer. But as the snorting got louder and closer, they thought, hmm, maybe it's a bear. And they darted back to their cars and they got inside and they locked the doors. Well, when they looked up, what they saw was a creature standing on its hind legs. It had long arms. And when the creature saw them, it turned around and walked back into the forest. Now they were very curious as to what this was. Scared, but curious. So what they decided to do is they went down the forest road in the direction where the creature had gone. And they never saw the creature again, but they did run into another couple that were in another car that were sitting there scared because they had seen the same thing. They didn't report it right away. They were a little worried because they didn't know if it was real or not real, and they didn't want to be ridiculed. Later, one of them decided that he would report it to the warden. So he told the warden about this incident. He told him about this animal that walked like this. They thought it was about eight feet tall because they could tell because it compared to the trees. It never was clear as to whether this was real or a well-executed hoax. next time on Red Earth Uncovered. I was on a hike, uh, it's called the Standing Glacier Hike. I was on the hike with five other friends and as we were coming down the hike, in the middle of the afternoon, uh, something crossed in front of my brother, jumped across the path that we were on and down the slope to the other side.